All right, people, what's going on? My name is Dananu, a.k.a. The Man with Black Privilege. And today we're bringing you some more Witcher 3. Uh, I finished out the last quest that I was doing before where I found the guy's brother and he paid me for it. So on the way back, since we got these healing items and I got weapons and swords and stuff to buy more if need be, we're going to settle if we can't kill these drowners and see what this treasure is. Because I think it's important because it is marked on the map, so... It might actually be uh, worth our time to waste these items and kill these three drowners. Because they uh, I know they weren't that tough. I mean, they're only level three, so... Come on, let's see if I can lure them one by one. See if we can't go in for some strong hits. Get outside of their reach. Alright, that's the big boy down. Alright, come on, who's next? Come on. Come on. I'm trying to pull you over here, man. Come on. I don't want to pull your friend over there. Alright, let me back off a little bit. Alright, alright, come on. Need to get my health back. Okay. Alright, so it looks like health items. I have to wait for them to actually stop regenerating, otherwise I'm just wasting them. It's good to know. I'm glad I just seen that just now. Because <laughs> they only, like, let's say, like, the big potato gives me, let's say, 10 seconds of health regen. If I hit it at 5, it's just going to take it back to 9. It's not going to give me, like, 14, so. Come on. Go in for two hits and then pull back. Dodge outside of his range and rinse and repeat. Problem solved. Alright. Uh, did I get his? There we go. Alright, let's see what they were trying to hide. Ooh. The cover blade. Hunting boots, take all. Yep, that was so worth it. Alright, let me uh, see if I can put one of those on. Yep, armor plus five. Eh. 27 and 33. Is this a silver sword? Nope, that's a steel sword. Eh, too bad the one I have is actually better. Oh well, at least I got a pair of boots and, and some other stuff out of it, so. Looked like I got a couple recipes too. Alright, let's see if we can't make our way back. Just coming out of the water like you're the horse from the from the curse of the undead Yoma. Just be glad he didn't stall my head in like he did Hikage. For those of you, uh, for those of you guys who uh, don't know what I'm talking about, Curse of the Undead Yoma, badass anime that came out in '89. If you're into anime, ninjas, and demons, go check that out. You will love it. It's pretty cool. Still can't get up there, though. Faster. Alright. Ah, uh, no, that's not the way I want to go. Can we just, like, fast travel? Let's hope this game isn't like Dragon's Dogma. Okay. We must find a fast travel post sign. Okay, so this is it is pointing me in the right direction. Alright. I just gotta keep moving. I do not want to jump down there and lose 
half my health. Slower. Okay. Gotta find a way to get down there. Let me just keep following it until I see something. Has to, has to, there, there has to be a bridge or a path or a crevice or something. Because I got over there the first time, so. Could have swore before I just went on around. Let me just try doing that again. Let me just stick to the path and see what I end up with. Next, it'll probably just take me right there, so. Here we go. And I'm assuming that the uh, th that the shops don't close, but maybe they do. I know blacksmith spot was burned down, so okay, they got new stuff. Death to the invaders. Oh, girl, what are you doing? Dwarf guy, guess what? About to sell you a bunch of stuff. Return customer, welcome. What can I do for you this time? Show me what you got. Alright. Should just sell him all of this stuff. Because it's not like I need it, so. He only got $300 on him, though. Well, sword sells for nine dollars. Are you serious? Well, I'm glad I got a bunch of them. Thought I would at least have like a couple hundred off of that. All right, let's see. Do I have the leather in order to make the? Uh... No, still need one more, one more leather strap, one more cured leather. Oh, that's actually something different. I don't remember this. But that's what I want to make. Let me see. That's better. Raises my armor by 15. Adds to all of my resistances. This raises my armor by 17. Increases armor and stamina regeneration. Lowers my damage from monsters and elemental damage. Since I'm playing on a higher difficulty, I'm gonna need damage more so than um than resistances. Cause I'm gonna be fighting monsters throughout the game, so having a negative ten, that's I'm not sure I like that. Let me see if let me let me see if he sells materials. Yes, he does. Okay, we might be able to make a few of them here then. Uh, no, I needed two more of these, so I'm gonna buy two of those. And I need one cured leather, not enough coin. I need 63. Okay. Means I'm gonna have to sell something. At least I'll get to make one set of armor, you know? And then I'm gonna need thirty something dollars in order to make it. Let me just sell both of that. Cause I need at least probably forty or fifty dollars in order to actually make it. And buy the you know what I need, so I think I think I said I need a one more of these and I need at least thirty. I think I said thirty two or thirty eight, one of the two.
Uh, I'm not going to use... Can't sell that to him. Great. Uh, powdered Pearl. That'll give me enough. I'm trying to sell, like, stuff that, you know, that's easy to come by. Monster Blood. Don't need that anytime soon. Let me see if that's enough. Yep. I can actually build this. I want this one, though. What's that? String? A wire? I know he sells that, so I could probably buy that. Leather scraps. Does he even sell leather scraps? Yes, he does. Okay, I need at least... I think it said two of these. And some wire. Okay, so can I, I can actually make both. I just gotta get more money. Okay. Alright. First of all, we're crafting this right here. Because I need to get better armor. And then, once I get some more money... We'll come back and we'll make that other one. So long. Okay. Time to get dressed. Uh, really? Okay. Not liking that. Not definitely not liking that YouTube. Definitely not liking that. But hmm. Let me see some. A return customer. Maybe Welcome. maybe I can maybe I can sell it. Show me what you got. And get my money back, or at least some of the money back. No, nope, I can only get twenty-eight. Alright. Looks like I'm gonna be looking like crap for a little bit. Cause it's better than what I got in, in some aspects and not another. So we're gonna be equipping it for a little bit until I get some money and then we're gonna buy that other set that he got. Uh, how much money do I have left? None. Okay. Uh. How many healing items do I have? Because I don't want to just be going out there with no healing items. Okay, so I still got some stuff. It's got some chicken, bread, raw meat. Okay. Alright. Let's go deal with this Witcher contract. Eh, might as well collect some of this stuff too. As I pass it. Where's the uh now oh, it's right there? Cause I know something's gonna, you know, at some point in the game I'm gonna come across an alchemist. And maybe I can earn a little bit of money by selling off all these plants. Does this place not have a door? Or did I just pass it on this side and didn't even see it? Yes, I did. Old line, what's up, man? Greetings, good man. Having trouble with your well? That's what I read. Why? Tis haunted. Has been for a good twenty years. Twenty? So why do you put out a notice just now? Because earlier on we drew our water from the river. But so many corpses floating in it after the battle has turned noxious. My daughter Mandy drank half a pitcher. Felt dreadful ill, can't keep nothing down. She grows worse by the day. Herbalist claims you fight a fever with drink. And not beer nor cider, but water. Clear, pure water. And where am I to get that if not from the well? But first, the ghost's got to be driven away. And it, don't let any man near. This ghost. Describe it for me. Well, it's awful frightening. Awful. I meant, what does it look like? It looks like a woman. 
but fresh from the grave. Wears a dirty dress, all rags, its skin flaking off its bones, and it howls like it's suffering. Some wraith, or maybe an alp. If you don't wallop it, master. If you don't take care of it, that is, it'll come kill me daughter. I feel for you, but this is my job, so let's talk about my pay. Something not right with the coin? No, I'm, I'm good. I mean, it's, it is what it is. That settles it then. I mean, I'm good. I mean, I'm an honest dude. I ain't gonna try to haggle this dude, man. He got his own problems. He's, you know, willing to pay me an honest coin. I'll do an honest day's work. Fine, I'll help. Where's this well? In Havel. A settlement on the heights. It's abandoned now. No one ventures there on account of the ghost being about. Drive it off. Please. I love how cinematic they make all the stuff look. That is what's up. Feeling this game. Like, I mean, I knew this game was going to have a lot of quality to it because, um... Yeah, he ain't going to be needing none of that. But, um... I played part two. And I've seen videos of part one and going from part one to part two, you can see where the quality was. And um, I don't know if they make any of other, you know, any other games besides The Witcher. Um, I know they got the, uh, uh, what do they call it, the Cyberpunk game coming out, but I, I knew this game was going to have tons of quality to it. And from what I've seen of their work, uh, CD Projekt Red don't do bullshit. And they don't cater to the publishing bullshit either, <laughs> like uh, Bungie and every, you know, all, a lot of other game developers. So I knew this game was going to have quality to it, but I, I'm definitely liking this. This game is like, so far, what I wanted it to be. I wanted this game to be my new Skyrim. And the only thing this game is missing is character customization as far as what you look like. But then again, I mean, they got to they gotta do that based on the story. So it is what it is. But I'm not knocking, I mean, you know, Geralt of Rivia is a pretty badass character in his own right. The infamous well. Whoa Strange. there, Roach. No sign of a ghost. Maybe it only shows at a certain time of day. Alright, well. Loot mode done. Let's get everything we can get. Why can't I walk over to a chair in my right? But, um... It's like, so far... I'm, and I'm probably going to make an impressions video. Um, but, so far, I haven't had a lot of problems with the game. I encountered, what, like, one glitch off camera? And it seemed like every once in a while, I get stuck on something trying to walk. But that's just because I'm probably walking... Walking into the hitboxes, so it, it's not like it's not like level ground. But other than that, I mean, haven't had no problems. I know that one weird glitch was uh, when you fast travel. Instead of just spawning in, it, it spawned the camera in too close, Journal. and might be useful. And the horse was kind of floating in midair, like he was standing there, but his legs was like raised up as if he was like laying on the ground. Even though horses don't really tend to do that, but that's what it looked like. And, and then after a couple seconds, he lowered his legs and was standing on the ground like normal. So, I mean, it wasn't like the glitch ended the game or nothing. I just had to, like, get off my horse for a quick second. All right, let's finish searching off all this stuff. And then we're going to read this journal and it's probably going to be like, oh, come back here at midnight or noon or something. And... Then, uh, and then I probably got to kill the ghost. So we're going to definitely save our game. Because I remember fighting ghosts in Witcher 2 and they killed me a lot. Uh, as a matter of fact, let me um, save my game right now before I read that journal. Alright. Journal quests. 
No, nope, wrong one. What's your contract? She's a much more kind of sort of something. Oh, well. Okay, so that just tells me the basics. That's not reading the journal that uh, I actually found. Where would that be at? My inventory? Yep. Okay, that's not telling me nothing. What's the second one? Gave me a bracelet. Maybe I gotta find that bracelet. Cause I know in The Witcher 2, you can either, or at least some ghosts. Um, I remember like the first two or three ghosts you came in the game. You can either put them to rest by let's say like I'm just you know just guessing this quest here but like um let's say they got that bracelet in their life and they talk about I'll, I'll never take it off it reminds me of the person I married or whatever and then they got killed violently right then the ghost will come back and you can either put them to rest by killing them which would complete the job and whatever you still get paid for it but I guess if you wanted to do let's say the good ending to the quest or whatever you can get the bracelet, give it back to him, and then that will put him at rest, and, and then the ghost will leave. So I'm guessing this is going to be the same way. But we'll see. Alright, so they pretty much told me about the bracelet. So maybe I gotta find the bracelet. Grass around the well scorched. around the well scorched grass around the well scorched okay okay so that's just gonna tell me the same thing about the grass anything my, my senses can detect in here I'm hoping to find like a bracelet or something not unless I just gotta kill the, you know, the ghost or whatever. <laughs> eh, what's in here? Can I look look down in the well? Eh, I guess I can't jump down in there. I don't want to risk it. Probably didn't find what I'm supposed to see yet. Like it killed this dog. Look, it looked like it skinned it. Grass around the well scorched. Okay, so he's just saying the same thing. Grass around the well scorched. Hmm. Huh. Nothing in here. I mean, let me go check this third house. All right, miscellaneous items, but not what we're looking for. Maybe I gotta wait here till midnight or or maybe when it's dawn or something but normally ghost stuff can go away at dawn and come out at night let me check that book out again Okay, so maybe the Lord killed the uh, killed the woman, you know, to get her to leave. I'm just trying to see if it says like a time or something. All right, I don't 
think I picked up a bracelet, but let me check. No, nope, that's a dish. Nope, no bracelet. Yeah, maybe there's something just around here that I'm just not seeing besides the grass. seeing anything seeing this but I can't click on dried to a crisp signs of burns all signs point to a new wraith now I clicked on that before how come it didn't show up all right let me check out the be sure because I have no idea what a noon wraith is uh, glossary? Be sure. Alright, let's see what they weak to. Alright, Erden, Spectre Oil, Moon Dust. At least I have Erden. They often held in this world by objects. See, look, look, just what I was saying before. That's why if one ever finds a one ever a torn veil in the middle of the field, one should not pick it up. Okay. Something's tied the noon wraith to this place. An object. Something she needs before she'll leave this world. Yeah, the bracelet. Obviously. Alright, let's see if we can find it. Looks like I just had to get the quest marker to tell me to look in the houses. What are you? Stabbed with a knife, died on the spot. Animals fed on his body, picked his skeleton clean. More blood stains over there, but it's not his blood. A man, stabbed with a knife, died on the spot. Animals fed on his body, picked his skeleton clean. More blood stains over there, but it's not his blood. A man, stabbed with a knife, died blood on the stains. spot. Barely Animals visible. Animals fed on his body, Someone picked his skeleton dragged clean. This way. Someone who was still alive. I oh, don't tell me they like dragged the woman's body and threw it down the well. That's fucked up. Palm prints in blood. Small hands. A woman's. Someone dragged her out. She was wounded. Fought for her life. No body in sight, but might still find some tracks. Under the right conditions, blood stains can remain visible for decades. Another print by the well. Hmm. All right. Since I know examining the well might actually trigger it, let me see if I can't find the uh, the uh, the bracelet first. That way, I can just give it to her. All right. Nothing here. Cause I know triggering a well is definitely gonna probably like you know cause the rave to try to kill me or something. And I know in Witcher 2 they at least talk you know talk to you a little bit. There we go. Come on, come on, one more. There we go. Smoking pipe. <laughs> Received old ass water from the cabinet. Alright, hopefully I can get out of here without getting stuck. Alright, here we go. Okay. Did I miss something in here? I saw the body. Now unless this, this is just telling me, uh, cause that's just telling me about the footprints and everything else. Hmm. 
Yeah, that's what I thought. I didn't miss nothing. Okay. All right. Maybe the the ghost will give me the quest to go find the bracelet somewhere else. Maybe whoever killed her took it. Blood stains, almost faded, but the lines taut. Something's not right. Yeah, it's probably her body. Yeah. The bucket rope. Woman, the journal belonged to. Must be. Wide pelvis, small jaw. A woman. Around thirty, judging by the teeth. Left arm's missing. Probably the one with the bracelet on it. Cremate the remains. Gotta find the object that binds her to this place before I do, though. Was she wearing the bracelet from her husband? Might be why her arm fell off. Gotta jump down there. Hope I don't break my legs. <laughs> All right. Ew. All right, let's check the water. Path. Uh, that's not a path. Better not have to kill like no evil fish or something. me to go. Oh, dive. Okay, that's what I wanted to do. Well, turn around. This better not be like the way out instead of finding the uh, what I need. I'll oh, hold it. Okay. I'm sitting here mashing it. <laughs> yeah, something tells me this is the way out and not the, uh... Not where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, this is the way out. Alright. Uh, looks like we gotta jump back down there. Nope, nope, Carol, no. No. Don't need to show off your acrobatic prowess, and son of a bitch! Damn you, girl. I should have just walked off. Alright. Alright, so I'm assuming it has to be somewhere right here. Because this is where a body was hanging, so. What is that? If it's not there, any kind of current would taking it where the wood, uh, where the water goes. So I don't see an arm laying on the ground. What is this? Why is this glowing? All right, let me get some more air and come back. Yeah, it's probably right here. Let's see, maybe I can interact with it? No. I do not see anything. It has to be down here somewhere. Why well, is this lit up though? Like I can touch it, but. Go back up. Because that's telling me the way out, but I don't see our arm anywhere. Yeah, that's just the way out. 
Oh, well, maybe I gotta use my Witcher senses on it. Yep, that's what I thought. Alright, leave the cave. That I can do. Yep. Come on, girl, go up. Go up. There we go. There we go. You got like some realistic swimming physics, and it's just weird, you know? Like in most games, you just press it and you just automatically go up. But no, like when you press up for him, he wants to go straight up. Lucky not to come up empty handed. A bracelet with an inscription to Claire from Volker. Bracelet must have belonged to the woman in the well. Lovely craftsmanship, but I'll have to burn it with the body to get rid of the noon wraith for good. Better do it near the well. All right, let's get up. Let's get up. Let's get up out of here. Oh. Something tells me this is this isn't going to be an exciting quest. Like I probably won't have to fight the wraith. I just probably got to burn the body and that's it. You know, I thought this was going to be a little bit more exciting, but I guess not. Guess they all can't be, you know, killing dragons and demons. Oh, come on, girl, hurry up. Alright, we good. P prepare. <laughs> prepare to Okay, so it looks like I do have the fight. Brew some wraith oil. Drink some potions. Yeah, I guess so. Do I even have anything like that though? I haven't brewed anything yet. Oh, well, maybe I got some stuff. Uh, mutagen, mutagen, mutagen. Spectre oil. Ingredients missing. Alright, this is gonna suck. Alright, since I can't brew anything. Let me put on the magic it was weak to. The trap. Okay. Save my game. Some tell me I might die a few times. Because if they're telling me, oh yeah, maybe I should, you know, brew some shit, then that tells me, like, this boss is this boss might be serious. Alright, where's the body? Did it magically disappear? Nope. Here we go. And the bracelet. Igni. Got a mean tongue on you, girl. If he wasn't undead, we might be able to do something. <laughs> I like how she's kind of like half faded. That's what's up. Okay. Alright. It's like my sword is going through her, but it's damaging her. Like, I don't get the little hit marker things. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, I gotta actually make her solid with the magic. Okay, that's what it is. Ah, I need to stop wasting my stuff. Alright. Alright, we good. 
right, where'd she go? Uh, she wasn't the real one. She wasn't the real one. She wasn't the real one. Alright, come on in here. Problem solved. She's gone. For good. Alright. Alright, fellas, let's go turn this in. I swear, every one of these quests is like 45 minutes. <laughs> I started this one thinking, it was like, oh, it's only going to be like 20 minutes. Nope. Going on 45 minutes. But it's cool, though. I mean, I don't mind doing long videos for you guys. I mean, I'm going to be playing it anyway. Might as well record it. I know a lot of YouTube channels, they don't want to do long videos like that because they got to render more. But it's like me, I just don't care. I'll just put it out. I don't hold videos and everything like that, so. Alright, dude. Your well is clear. Job done. The well was haunted by the ghost of a woman who was killed there. I drove it away. I just hope every unburied wretch don't start haunting us. Well, that battlefield's gonna cause us a heap of trouble. If they do, you know who to contact. Meanwhile, Claire, Volker, Names ring a bell? I don't know him. Though I did hear our herbalist Tamira mention a Claire once. Same one, maybe? Your reward, Master Witcher. The gold I'd hid away for Mandy's dowry. Without you, she'd never have lived to wed. Now, there's hope for it, at least. Mm. Yeah, after that quest, I'm not going to be a dick, man. At this point, doubt I'll ever marry. You keep the coin from Mandy, her wedding. Raise a toast to my health then. Thank you, Master Witcher. Them's warm words, you've a good heart. But I can't let you go empty handed. Take this at least. For luck. That's what's up. Amethyst. Alright, people. Let's We're going to end this video here. So comment down there if you guys have anything to say. But otherwise, me and uh, Geralt of Rivia, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, y'all.